In this section, we will talk about the application process, which starts with the eligibility screen. When you go to the application website, you will likely need to create an account unless you have applied to a PSU scholarship before. Please remember your password. You will need this to get back in to work on your application. If you are applying from an Exito institution other than PSU, please know that all applications are funneled through the PSU system. So you will see a Portland State University logo on the banner of your application. The very first part of the application is called the eligibility screening. You will need to complete the screening first to advance to the full Build Exodo application. The eligibility screening for Exodo ensures that you meet the basic criteria for the Build Exodo program. If you're eligible for Build Exodo, you will be given the chance to proceed to the full application. This is only the first step. When you finish the eligibility screening, the text will say, congratulations, application submitted. After you receive your approval on that page, you will have a chance to select the full Build Exodo application and move directly on to start your full app. If you want to work on the full application at another time, you will also receive an email confirmation. This email confirmation will say that you've completed the eligibility screening. This confirmation email will include a link to the full 2019 Build Exodo Scholar application. If you get a message saying you are not eligible, you will have an opportunity to contact someone at your institution if you think you might be eligible. Here are some things to keep in mind. Once you are through the eligibility screening, the system will take you to the Build Exodo application. You can start the application whenever you're ready and your information will be saved every time you navigate to another page of the application using the Save Progress button. You do not have to complete the application in one sitting. If you want to complete your application at a later date, click Save and Log Out. When you click on the full application and log in, some of the demographic and personal information that you completed during the eligibility screening will be transferred automatically. However, there will be a few new additional fields that you will need to complete. Please fill out each field in the, to the best of your ability. If an answer is required, you will see a red asterisk just after the question. The first section of the application is a series of questions about your personal history and background. Specific demographics are not required to be a part of Build Exodo. Anyone is welcome to apply and can be accepted into the program. However, we do ask these questions because we want to know as much as possible about our prospective scholars as we make up decisions about who will be in our next cohort. We welcome students of color, students with disabilities, students with lived experiences in foster care, and other students from diverse backgrounds and experiences to apply. We appreciate your willingness to share this personal information with us, and you can be assured that it is kept confidential. Please let us know if there's anything that we can do to assist you in putting forth your best application.